How are you here before us, dwarf? We were told our path was the only one between realms. Well, it may be the only way for you to travel, but we dwarves are full of surprises. That is not an answer. Ah, hang on to that sense of wonder. There's so little mystery once you've amassed the wealth of arcane knowledge that I have. Where to comb the realms for exotic resources. How to craft them into creations that defy imagination. To the novice, I'm sure it all seems like magic, but... Uh, oh, all right. It's magic. Are you happy now? Sindri, have you always been so... Clean? Huh. Don't I wish. No, I was just as unsanitary as the next dwarf until the day a Vanir witch set me straight. She discovered with her magic there are hundreds of thousands of tiny beasties on everything around us. Oh, so small you can't even see them. No. It's true. And if they get inside you, they make you sick. But the witch told me there's one wood, the oak, that's a natural deterrent. Stops the beasties from spreading. So now, I make all my handles from oak. See? I think of these things. Okay, back to work. So how come Brock's blue and you're not? Why? Oh, it's fine. Very good question, actually. You see, my brother's not as careful as I am. In fact, he prefers to work with metals using... Oh, his own bare hands. Ugh. No gloves. Says it's the only way he can hear what it wants to be. Touch enough raw silver and it changes your skin irreparably. That means forever. I wouldn't bring it up to him, though. <laughs> you know how sensitive he would be. I guess that makes sense. Sindri, why don't you just make up with your brother already? Me? Make up with him? Because he's an obstinate pighead incapable of change. Because he says the most terrible things about me, just because he's insecure about his own work, which, let me tell you, is subpar. Because he blames me for... for the things that aren't my fault. Huh? Like what? Would you pardon me, please? I need to collect myself. So, what can I do for you two? This way. We're inside. Of course. A 
decent start. I bet it was beautiful here before the dark elves destroyed everything. Whoa! Now that's impressive. What does it say? From darkness, keep safe the light. Didn't do a very good job, did they?
There, the light. They've covered it up with that stuff. Why would they do that? Look. Another light up. What's he doing? Oh no! Why are they killing him? He didn't do anything. Do not assume. You are seeing the end of a war, boy. You do not know what led to this moment. But he didn't even defend himself. That was his choice. We make ours. near. Look for a way inside. Follow me. It is over. You're restoring all the pathways.
maybe we can go this way. supposed to be in here. Quiet. Did you hear that? Stay alert and by my side. Hey, when we make it to the light, how do you think we get it into the Bifrost? The witch said to step into it. She did? When she was ripped away from this realm. Oh, how did I miss that? You are more concerned with her safety than our goal. Is that a bad thing? If one prevents the other. Quiet! I have him. Your knife boy. Between your volleys. What happened to Adders down the street? There are many targets. You will not miss. <laughs> A narrow path negates superior numbers. Stay focused.
are you injured? I'm fine. Wow. It's beautiful. The light. It's making the whole temple reappear. It's the source of all of it. Wait. It's... It's singing. I hear... I hear her! I told you I heard her! Do you think she's in there? Ah! Ah! Oh, I really hurt. I feel like my hand was on fire. Stay here. But I want to Stay go. here. Only use it as a last resort. You're giving me your axe? I'm letting you hold my axe. It is not a gift. Still. seem to want to. I'm strong. I'm smart. I'm not what he thinks I am. I know better. He doesn't talk to me. Doesn't teach me. It should have been him. Do you hear me? Him, not you. She was better. I know he can. So if he tries, I'll try. But if he doesn't, please come back. I know you're out there somewhere. Only... Moments. No! You've been gone a long, <coughs> long time. I didn't know what to do. You left me here again. <coughs> Why don't you care? <sighs> That's impossible. 
We should go before they come back. I hoped you got what you needed. Yes. Look, there's our exit. But there's no light to make a bridge. We're trapped, and the witch's bowstring is useless. Boy, your bow. Hold it out. On my mark, loose your arrow into the stone. It worked! We can now make our way back. Come. <laughs> 